must do. I inspired to the purity of the blessed machine. Hello everyone. Today we're going to be doing a quick tutorial about how to do the Adeptus Mechanicus voice from the Warhammer 40k universe. They're essentially the remnants of the people who went to Mars and became a cybernetic cult that worships the machine god, the Omnissiah. So that's why their voice sounds so distorted and broken because they're essentially more machine than man. So to do this voice you're going to need to download Audacity, as with all my videos. I have the link here on the video at the top of the screen and please do be sure to download it from this site because since it's an open source software it is easy for malware to be attached to the software if you download it from any other site. But Audacity is the best, I think, free audio software you can find. Next, you're going to want to record your track and then clean up your audio by essentially doing some noise reduction, applying a compressor and then applying a normalizer. And those things I do have in the description below in quite a bit of detail. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. So now with your cleaned up audio, what you're going to want to do is select your track and drop the pitch by about 8 to 10 decibels. This is more depending on your voice, but this is what I found to work for my voice. You might just need to adjust it as necessary. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. Then you're going to copy that track and paste it into the second track as a duplicate and then drop the pitch of the second track down by another 20 decibels and reduce the gain slightly. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. Then you're going to want to apply a low pass filter to the second track. And just copy the numbers you see on the screen here for my low pass filter. Then you're going to want to copy the second track to a third track in another duplication. Then you're going to reverse this third track and apply a church reverb to the track. To get the church reverb you just go to manage and then go to factory presets and select church reverb. Once you apply the church reverb then you're going to reverse the track again. And you only do this for the third track. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. Now you're going to need the Killeringer plugin. So I'm going to put the link to the Killeringer plugin in the description below. And just download it and copy the .dll to, to your Audacity folder in the, in the plugin subfolder. Then in your program you're going to go to add remove effects and then ensure that Killer Ringer is enabled through there. Then you're going to set everything in Killer Ringer to zero except for the amount which you're going to set to 0 0.15399. If applying the Killer Ringer deletes your audio or mutes your audio, just adjust the other two amounts while, while starting the playback and it should fix the issue. Hi guys, this is Luke from the future. I just do want to say, the Killer Ringer plugin is extremely finicky. You're probably going to need to mess around with it quite a bit to try to get the perfect um, mix between flickering sound and your actual voice. Even in this tutorial here, I had to mess around with it for quite a bit. So just understand that this plugin is not perfect in any means. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. I crave the strength and certainty of steel. I aspired to the purity of the blessed machine. And now you can apply bass and treble to track one and set both of them to about and set both of them to about six. Now apply hard overdrive distortion to track one with both numbers at 33. 
So this is in the effects distortion area. And select hard overdrive. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. I crave the strength and certainty. Now, copy the first track and paste it into another fourth duplicate. And then increase the pitch of that track by 12, but reduce the gain by quite a bit. From the moment I understood the weakness of my flesh, it disgusted me. And there you have it. And now your voice should sound like an Adeptus Mechanicus, a member. Don't worry about your voice going too over the threshold, because any other distortion still adds to the Mechanicus sound effect, even if it's unintentional. Right, that's all you need to know. I hope you enjoyed.